It's officially a first alert weather day. Live look over Dallas right now and 34 degrees, two degrees above freezing. So we're going to go from wet to freezing here fairly soon. And if and when there would be a power outage due to the storm, local rec centers and libraries, by the way, will not have backup generators to keep the heat on. And candidly, that wasn't the plan. After last February's widespread power outages, the city did start working on how to handle a similar event in the future. But the $2 million project to provide generators simply will not be ready in time. Andrea Lucia looking into that for you tonight. So why couldn't they get it done in time? Yeah, we know, to be clear, Dallas is not expecting these same large-scale power outages, but it wants to be prepared just in case, and it's blaming supply chain issues for the delay in getting generators into rec centers like this one. Millions of Texans lost power last February as temperatures plunged below freezing and stayed there. For the city of Dallas, records show the crisis helped identify a need to maintain a backup source of power at various facilities throughout Dallas to provide residents with warming or cooling centers in the event of extended power outages during severe weather. Hearing none, all in favor say aye. Any opposed? Ayes have it. This fall, city council approved a total expense of $2 million for eight fixed generators at select libraries and rec centers and an additional eight mobile power units with generators and heating systems that could be deployed where needed. Unfortunately, they will not be ready for this winter season. The city's director of emergency management, Rocky Vaz, last month told council the generators had arrived but will take six to eight months to install and that due to ongoing supply chain issues, it still lacked heaters and trailers for those mobile power units. Regardless, Vaz says the city is in better shape than it was last year. Uh, we have you know, warming sites, we have prepositioned uh, supplies, uh, we have contracts in place, uh, we have water distribution if we have to do that. Yeah, if there were to be widespread power outages, the city says it is prepared to send out coach buses, much like it did uh, last year, to wherever they're needed to give people a place to sit and get warm. That is not something they are expecting uh, to have to do. But again, they want to have these plans just in case. Reporting live in Dallas, Andrea Lucia, CBS 11 News. Andrea, thank you so much for the update. Well